Hi there everyone, welcome to Engineering with Pritam. In this video, we will talk about a very important setting that we should do inside AutoCAD. This is going to save a lot of our time. So stay tuned guys. In this video, we will talk about how we can permanently save some of our customization that we always do inside our drawing so that we do not need to do again and again, such as defining units turning off certain settings on and off, how we can save it permanently. So let's see how we can do it. For that, let me click here on this menu button and you know, start AutoCAD. Okay, so there we go. This is how AutoCAD 2024 look like. And if I click here on new, I did some customization in past, for example, I um, made some modification in my unit system. But again, if I see here, I turned down the precision to one, but it was there till my session. But after I exit from AutoCAD, everything became as usual the way it was. So here I prefer precision to be up to only one decimal. And here I prefer decimal as length type. Similarly, in case of angle, I would say everything is good, um, but I'm gonna make it up to one decimal. And here in unit, I'm gonna make it a millimeter as this is my preferred scale and maybe it is true for most of us, um, especially somebody from Asian country. Now let me keep all other setting as it is and hit okay. What's more I would like to customize it is, let me actually show you this dimensional style. I also do not want that every time I need to go here and then I need to change the dimensional style. Instead, I would prefer if I can save these settings permanently. So again, here, let me click on modify and then here in case of precision, I'm gonna make it up to 0.1. Now let me hit okay and close. You can also make the customization that you want, for example, Let's say you want to um, turn on certain settings. For example, I want polar tracking to be there at every 30 degree step. And I also would like to turn on this object snap. Now all my settings are saved. And here also you can see, um, you know, it is also being reflected the way I want. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go here on this top AutoCAD button and then I'm going to click on save as and I will create a new template that store all my settings and customization. Now, instead of directly saving it as DWG, I'm gonna choose DWT, which is AutoCAD drawing template. Now here I can give it a name, for example, my template, or maybe if you work in certain organization, um, you can give your department name or, you know, it's up to you. So. In my case, I'm going to keep it as my DWG and then I'm going to click on save. And then since I use MM, therefore I'm going to select here metric and then I'm going to click OK. So what basically this will do is next time, whenever I'm going to start, you know, AutoCAD, it will keep all my settings saved if I start new file using my template for that here i'm gonna click on this down arrow and then i'm gonna click on browse template here i should find my template which is my dwg now let me click here on open and if now i plot this um you know line or even i go to this autocad symbol and then inside this drawing utilities units here i would see all my settings are saved the way i want even if I let's say create this dimension here, you will find that it only shows up to one decimal point. And this is exactly what we want. In this way, guys, we can save all our settings. Maybe you would like to keep your font or maybe you would like to change this leader style. All you can do it and can save it as a template and you can use the same template whenever you want. So in this way, guys, we can save all our settings permanently inside AutoCAD. I hope that you find this video helpful and informational. If yes, then do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more such content. 
and i will catch you soon in another video of this autocad complete course series till then you take care and bye bye